Greetings, I'm here today with an update on the passions that are brewing around the yet-to-be-released movie Meet Me at the Lake. Let me remind you that the Dukes of Montecita intend to make a movie Meet Me by the Lake, and Netflix has bought the rights to adapt this novel. So, this has all greatly alarmed not only the royal family, but also Princess Diana's family. And the whole thing is that the Sussexes have chosen a movie that is strikingly similar to their lives with their childhood mental traumas, growing up in a single-parent family and other problems that Harry described in his book The Spare. The Sussexes once again want to stir up a hornet's nest by making references to a sad past that affects not only themselves, but also Prince William, who just like Harry, suffered the loss of one of his parents. But worst of all, Meghan and Harry are also making money from it. And although the rights to the novel by author Carly Fortune acquired Netflix, paying $3 million. However, Meghan and Harry are now hastily looking for sponsors who would be willing to take on the costs associated with filming. The process, as we understand, is not cheap, and if you also take into account that for Sussex absolutely everything will be done by others, and their names will only stand in the credits, along with the name of their company Archwell Production, so and at all expensive. Those willing to become sponsors have not yet found, but the Dukes anticipate a large box office, which will help them to increase the payback of filming, and all this at the expense of the so-called Diana card. This is exactly what the Spencers are worried about, who are very annoyed that Diana's movie image is constantly being distorted to suit filmmakers, driven by the sole purpose of profiting from Lady Di's unhappy personal life and mental health. And now Diana's sister, Lady Sarah McCorkodale, is outraged at her nephew and his wife's attempts to reuse her mother's image in order to increase interest in the movie. Sarah has always been close to Diana and was once even her maid of honor, accompanying her sister on overseas humanitarian trips. Sarah and her sister Jane accompanied Charles to Paris after the Alma Tunnel incident on August 31. The Spencers never lost touch with Diana's sons, keeping in close touch with them. Now Lady Sarah has become very angry with the Sussexes, claiming that the pair are preventing Diana's soul from finding the peace it longed for by constantly disturbing her memory. Sarah called attempts to use parallels to Harry's mother in the movie distasteful and disrespectful, adding that Diana and the entire Spencer family had endured enough slander from movie and bookmakers. Lady Sarah, Jane and Earl Spencer have come out strongly against the exploitation of Harry's mother's name in his and Meghan's future films. Wake up, as they say. I don't want to talk about which side is right and which side is wrong. I think the Spencers have extra income from this whole story, and the Sussexes are trying to make money too. Who's right and who's wrong, time will tell, as always. Thank you for watching.